Oh, did you actually leave the animal? No, not the animal. Uh oh. Oh, you go, oh, you go, oh, you go, oh, you go. Ooh, that's <laughs> 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 Okay, Peter, good to go. Thanks, Naomi. Good afternoon, everybody. Um, my cell phone and Naomi both tell me it's three o'clock Eastern time. So uh, we'll kick this off and I'm sure we'll have some other folks uh, jumping in as we go along here. Uh, welcome to today's webinar. Today, we're gonna be providing some highlights of TCI Expo 23, which is coming up in, uh, oh, I don't know, something like 28 days in St. Louis. Missouri. Um, I'm Peter Gersenberger. As I said, I'm senior VP of uh, industry support at TCI. At TCI A. I'm also the expo director uh, for the first time this year, and we're very uh, pleased to be west of the Mississippi in St. Louis for the first time ever uh, this coming November. Uh, before we get into the heart of this presentation, I uh, just have a few housekeeping items. We expect the presentation today is going to last between 30 and 45 minutes. We're going to have a Q&A session at the end. And so through the duration of the presentation, we're going to keep you all muted. Um, at any point in time, if you want to field a question, uh, please use the chat feature here in Zoom. We have quite a few staff at Presently, I think we have more staff on here than we have participants. So we have a lot of folks keeping tabs on those on those questions and you'll get prompt answers either through the chat or uh, we may field it to John at the end of the session and discuss it as a group, depending on the nature of the question. And so we're, we have you muted, but we are keeping tabs on your chat. Um, at the end of this session, 
you're going to be asked to participate in a very brief survey. Uh, doing so will just help us improve these webinar experiences going forward. So we'd really much appreciate it if you would participate in this very short survey. Uh, that we are being recorded today, and you can tell your friends and colleagues in the industry that if they want to hear any of what we've talked about today, uh, they can go to TCIA.org and go to the business solutions page there, and they'll find a posting of this webinar. And now it is my pleasure to introduce the MC of this afternoon's webinar, Mr. John Lewis. Uh, John is our member experience manager for the Midwest region of the country. John is a Cleveland native. Uh, I'm a snob, Midwest snob. I was born in Iowa. And I say, you're really not in the Midwest until you see the Mississippi River in your in your rearview mirror. But we'll give him we'll give him that. It's close enough. Um, again, really happy to be in the Midwest for the first time. Uh, we have, a, I think, some really cool highlights to show you about this year's show, which is shaping up to be another record breaker. Uh, certainly is in terms of uh, uh, the exhibitors. Um, so without any further ado, I'll kick it over to John. Thanks, Peter. Thanks for the introduction. Um, really excited to be here. We're really excited to to visit St. Louis. It's going to be my, one of my first trips to, to St. Louis. I've been lucky enough to visit Kansas City a number of times with my time with TCIA, and I'm just excited to get to the Gateway City and, and really experience um, you know, obviously our, our, our event, but really just connect with everybody there. So we're just super excited to get there. And one of the things I wanted to point out about us going to the Gateway City is being our first time there. Um, really what I think is, is just great is just the excitement that's already building for the expo. Uh, you know, when I'm in my role at TCIA, I'm talking to our members on a daily basis and I'm getting really just pumped up just from the phone calls and, and, talking to everybody about what what we're going to experience at the event. We're going to cover that today. Uh, any questions that we, we talked about prior, um, please don't hesitate to put them in the chat. We have, like we said, we have a, a large contingent of TCIA representatives here to make sure that we can answer every question for you. And we'll go through everything and make sure you're well-informed and try to maximize your experience at the expo. I'll just give you one moment here. So, at the Expo this year, we are anticipating record attendance, which is really exciting. We're anticipating over 4,500 attendees. We have 275 exhibiting companies um, from all over the tree care industry. Um, our 2,000 exhibitor personnel are there to help and assist. So we encourage you to, um, if you have any questions while you're at the event, if you're seeing, you know, we'll all be wearing our TCIA shirts. They'll be black. We'll have a name tag. We're all going to be there to assist you. Our goal is to really make sure that you enjoy it and maximize it. Now, one of the things that I think is really cool, um, and, and this is probably because I'm, as Peter said, I'm from Ohio, big Ohio State football fan. We're, you know, the, the field, the experience of the exhibit space itself is seven football fields long. And I'm going to talk about one of the football fields later. Uh, it's really going to be really exciting. Um, that's going to be a part uh, of the expo. So we'll, we'll talk, uh, we won't talk football. We're going to talk tree care today, but I think it's great that, this is our largest footprint to date. Uh, and that's, to me, really exciting um, just to get there and have, have that size of an experience. So if you've never been to a TCI Expo, one of the things about it is there's so much to do, so much to see. And, and this year, it's really going to be, um, it's really going to be eye-opening. So uh, we're really excited about the space that we're going to be taking you all to. Now, if this is your first time attending an Expo, there, there's there's a really good cadence to what's going to help you kind of get there and be successful and do what you need to there. Now, the first step, obviously, we want you to register for an all-access pass. Registering first is just smart. You want to be prepared as you get there. Now, as an aside from going and talking about this, I'm going to jump off the page a little bit. If anyone has any questions on registration at all, um, please feel free to put that in the chat. I'll be happy to reach out to you right after we're done. If you haven't registered yet, I'll even I'll be happy to you know handle your registration for you to make sure it's done and accurate. It'd be my pleasure to work with you to get that done. Um, and then if you have any other questions after that that aren't answered in the chat, we can address those as well. So when you are registering for the expo, uh, you can do that at, at the on the TCIA site, um, but also on the X TCI expo site. Um, 
one of the things that I, I really recommend is um, for accommodations. The TCI has a number of rooms that have already been booked off and there are there is still a, availability for some of those rooms. So um, once again, if you have any questions on those accommodations, just feel free to put them in the chat. Um, somebody will definitely address it for you. One of the most helpful things for me, for me as just not only as a TCI employee attending the event, is the TCI Connect app. And, you know, in these days, we all have one of these. And sometimes we want to throw this out the, over our shoulder because it's so aggravating. But when you're at the event, I can promise you that you're going to want to keep this handy. You're going to want to download the TCIA Connect app because that's going to be really your, and I'm going to use this word again, gateway um, to really having the best experience because you're going to be very well informed by having the app. Not only will you be able to connect with your colleagues in the app, you'll be able to have a map of the show floor and you'll be alerted to all of the events and things that are taking place during um, and if there's something that you want to see, you're able to create your own schedule as well. So this really is that tool that's going to maximize your, your experience. So I really encourage you to download the app. Um, if you have any questions on it, like, like, like I've said before, don't, don't hesitate to, to, you know, put that in the chat or at the end of this. Uh, and I'm sure somebody on my team would be happy to do this. I'll provide my direct email. If anyone would like to reach out to me and my contact information, if, if we need to help you out, I'd be happy to do that. Now, I'm an old dog, and sometimes you can't teach an old dog new tricks. Um, and social media used to be something that would be, like, oh my goodness, it's something I'm really, you know, afraid of. But here, we want, we encourage you to to jump on the social media bandwagon because it's a lot of fun you know, to connect with your colleagues. You know, sometimes we don't get a chance to see all of our all of our tree friends on a regular basis because, you know, unfortunately we're all busy. Um, but when we're there these memories that you create are, are gonna last a, a lifetime. So we really encourage you to share them with all your friends and colleagues in the industry. Don't be afraid to take a picture. If you wanna even take a picture with me, I'll allow it and I'll let you share it. And I'm not very photogenic, but you know, I'll allow that. So if you come and see me in the membership booth, we'll, we'll take a nice picture and we'll post it together, all right? So one of the new things this year, and this is really, when I was talking about those seven football fields, well, guess what one of them is? It's our Demo Dome. So the Demo Dome uh, is the original home of the St. Louis Rams. Now, you know, um, us being from New England, uh, you know, with the Patriots up here, the Rams are now in, in California, but that's all right. So we'll, uh, we'll allow it. We'll, we'll have a good time on the, on the Rams football field. So that space itself is going to be dedicated to really where, if you look at the Demo Dome and what it is, it's the TCIA true crew training hub. So that training hub is, you know, you're going to be able to run simulators on cranes. You're going to have the opportunity to, to test drive some of these knuckle booms and aerial lifts, like kind of that try before you buy, but really just that experience. So, you know, we encourage you to get out on that floor, um, take, you know, take advantage of the fact that this equipment is there for you. And these, you know, our, our, our corporate members that are there to assist you, they want to provide you with the most information possible to really keep you well informed on, on new equipment. So that's going to be really exciting, you know, dry, you know, test driving a stick crane or, or, or a, one of the simulators that's going to be provided um, by the New Jersey crane expert comp.com team. They're all going to be there. Um, so that'll be really exciting. So we really are, are excited to offer this. this is the first time we've done this and really the opportunity to not have something weather impacted is really the exciting thing for me um, because I want to, I really want to run one of the simulators, one of the cranes myself. So hopefully if I get some time, I'll get a chance to do that too. So I'm, I'm equally as excited just as a, as a member of TCIA, but also, uh, you know, I get to experience a little bit of, of what you folks are going to. And that's, that's going to be really, really one of my highlights of going there. Um, so I'm going to just move along a little bit. The about the about the tree uh, about the TCIA crane crew training hub, um, and really where that's going to be now for those that are attending, the the hub itself is anyone can any pass can attend. So uh, whether it be the all access or the or the trade show floor only, anyone will have the opportunity to to go and visit with the New Jersey crane team and all the all the vendors that are there. Um, but some of the topics, as you can see from the PowerPoint, um, covering, you know, obviously crane setup and cribbing, 
understanding slang angles and you know obviously tie-in points and more so that the best part about that is it, it's the hands-on aspect of it but what i really like about it too is it's very inclusive so as you notice we're going to have some bilingual sessions there as well with with to help with train uh, some of our spanish speakers so that's really really exciting too um, and if anybody can count how many times I say exciting or gateway uh, throughout this presentation, I might have a prize for you. All right. So I do want to talk a little bit about um, some of the main stage sessions in the Ferrera Theater. These are essentially keynote uh, keynote addresses. Uh, and our first one, I think, is really exciting by Mark Sinat, a uh, big wall climber, adventurer, writer, author, New York Times bestseller. Um, if you haven't looked uh, if you haven't been exposed to anything Mark's done before, or you're curious, I really encourage you to just Google uh, to Google Mark and, and learn a little bit about him. And I think that once you learn a little about him, you're going to be even more excited to hear hear his talk. Um, so, so don't be afraid to to you know get up real early and go to that first these first sessions. That's going to be really exciting. The other thing is the folks from Joseph Tree, my friends in Columbus, Ohio. Um, how to effectively hold people accountable for that session. So all these sessions are, are really a, a great way to kick it off. Um, the one session that I'm really looking forward to is the conversation with the industry that's taking place on the 18th at eight o'clock. That with David White and the ISA CEO, uh, Caitlin Polhan, that should really give up, give us all uh, that that morale boost to say, hey, you know, we're, we're, we're all pulling in the right direction. So that'll be a really great topic too. Uh, now, if you haven't heard uh, Joe and Corey do their, their podcast, uh, you're, you're really going to enjoy this one because they're doing it live. So what better way to actually connect with Corey and Joe than to actually see them do their podcast and have the opportunity to ask them some questions in person afterward. Um, I know Joe really well. He's one of the nicest guys. And even though he's a Michigan guy, I'm, a, I'm an Ohio guy. Joe's one of the best guys and one of the really a, a true leader in our industry. We're really glad that he and Corey are going to be there. So, so some of the pre-conference workshops, I'm going to talk uh, really quickly about the pre-conference workshops. The pre-conference workshops are separate from the all-inclusive pass, the, the all-access pass. So there are some opportunities for registration for these events. Um, so if you have any questions on registering for the CT, CTSP recertification or the Trees and Tech Summit, there is an additional cost that goes along, but there is availability for seating um, in these events. However, the Stop the Bleed is near capacity. So if you do have an interest in the Stop the Bleed session, um, please let us know as soon as possible so we can ensure that you get admittance to that event. Um, these are These events themselves offer the most CEUs. So if you're really looking to really get the most CEUs you can from the events at, at the show, that's going to be a good opportunity for you there. And I just wanted to pause for one moment and see if we had anyone in the chat that had any questions that need to be addressed. And if, you know, just for one moment, if we haven't addressed anything, and that's going to give me an opportunity to take a sip of water and Go from there. All right, I'm gonna to continue to move along with our presentation. So one of the questions that I get asked on a regular basis is, you know, why should I get the all access pass? Well, I don't like to miss anything. I don't miss dinner. I'm not missing the all inclusive pass because I want to gain as much information about our industry as possible. So I want to attend as many of our sessions as possible. Now, we can't attend every session. Unfortunately, um, that's one of the things we can't just, you know, sp split away and, and, and take time away from certain sessions. So we're actually recording every session for you. So every session at the end of each evening will be available uh, at the end of the e at the end of the day session, I believe, uh, by six, six o'clock that evening, I believe they'll be uploaded. So you can, you'll be able to get every session, you just won't be able to get everyone in person because of the, the number of educational sessions, but you'll have the opportunity to get that digital access. And as you can see from the PowerPoint right here, we'll have access to the 31st of January. So we've extended that time period. We actually heard last year from our from our attendees that, hey, we really wish we could have that just a little bit longer. We heard you. 
and we've added some time to that to, to maximize that for you. Now, this is really cool. I mean, anytime you can get on the trade show floor and actually see the work being done and actually, you know, really see how to do this up close and with these demos are really great. So obviously some of the, um, some of the expert presenters that are there are, are going to cover those topics that are listed right here. Uh, your rigging, your aerial rescue, cable bracing, uh, climbing efficiency, and, and really a lot more. So that, that's why this, this event really is taking it to the next level. We're, we're adding more in, in every phase of the game. Now, who wouldn't want to go to a playground? Well, our playground is the climber's playground. Um, as you can see, we have eight live trainers that are going to be, oops, I apologize for that. Um, we have eight live trainers that are going to be uh, there. They're, you know, as you can see, we've listed all of our trainers going to be there. It's going to give you an opportunity to really kind of just try everything. You know, that's that's the goal. Oh, sorry about that, guys. Um the, you know, you're going to learn the pros and cons of climbing, obviously getting tips. Um, but the, the great thing about this is too, is you're, you're getting exposure to a lot of the new gear and hardware and setups. That's important. You want to always stay ahead of the curve with, you know, what's new and what's you know really going to help you be more efficient um, to when you're in the field. So uh, we really encourage the climbers play, play, uh, playground um, for anyone attending. That's going to be a really great event. And, and once again, anyone can attend. That's a, that's all, all passes will be able to experience the, the event. Now the open trust um, at Expo Climb, this is the best part, trying all the gear. So if you are looking to add to your um, your stock of climbing gear and you are looking to find out what's new and exciting, this is where you're going to test and try. Um, and by doing that, you can attend and also get some CEUs. So what a great way to, to, um, to learn about what's new and exciting and put your hands on some of this new equipment, but even better, just, you know, you're going to get some CEUs out of it if you need those CEUs too. Now we all like to we all like to get education. We all like to see what's new. We all want to have uh, a great time with the the education and connecting. But one of the best parts about coming to Expo, as I said before, for me is connecting with all my friends. And what better way to do that than than at a happy hour? So we are going to host a happy hour on on Thursday from three to five, and that's a great chance for you to just you know after uh, a long day of walking the trade show floor and coming and going and you know, going to all these sessions, what better way to unwind with some, you know, some fun conversations with some of your friends you haven't seen in a while. So take time to connect with some of the exhibitors while you're there. Um, and, and really, it's a great networking opportunity. And really, when I'm just going to share this with, with you folks, too, one of the things that for me, when people ask me what really is so important about TCIA, for me personally, I find that we're a community. And what better way to, to really connect than than just you know, over a couple cold ones, whether that be beer, wine, soda, um, just to unwind and relax. So we're really excited to um, to have you come there. And it's obviously a cash bar um, throughout the entire trade show floor, including the demo dome as well. So we really are looking forward to uh, to hosting you at that event as well. Now, if you have not had an opportunity to uh, attend the TCI Expo before, you're in for a real treat. Uh, one of our sponsors, Vermeer, puts on a, an unbelievable event every year. And this year, it's really, it's no different. Uh, Vermeer is, we're partnering with, obviously, Budweiser. We're going to be um, having a, a really nice event at the uh, at the headquarters uh, of, of Budweiser right here in St. Louis. So that'll be on Thursday from 5.30 to 8. One of the best things is, too, we don't expect you to walk. We're going to provide transportation to and from. And... I would recommend that as when you're there, there should be plenty of signage and there'll be a, a lot of TCIA staff there to, to direct you on, on where to go for, for transportation. Um, but at the event, it's from 5.30 till 8. 
And if you haven't seen it, seen the Clydesdales up close, you're in for a treat. Those suckers are really big and it's going to be really cool to uh, take some pictures with uh, some of the cool horses that are there. Um, it's a night of beer and barbecue. You can't, can't get any, uh, can't get any better than that, but really it's an opportunity for, you know, for more connection, you know, to really enjoy your community, our community. And, and we're excited to have you there. And I know Vermeer is, um, you know, they put on a top flight event uh, as they do every year, and this will be no different. Um, in fact, this will, you know, whenever you say barbecue, I think it's just going to be the best one yet because of barbecue, but that's, that's just my opinion. So folks, I, just wanted to say thank you for taking the time and, um, you know, listening to us tell you a little bit about the expo, trying to get, you know, as, as much excitement going as possible, as you can tell, um, I'm very excited, but I, for everyone that stuck around and, and endured my, my presentation, uh, I have a little trivia question for everyone and I have a little gift for whoever can get it right. So when we're at the expo, I'm going to award you with a really nice TCIA Yeti mug. I got a little nice little mug right here. And if anyone could answer this trivia question in the chat, um, I'll be happy to, to present you with this beautiful Yeti when we're in, in St. Louis. So really easy trivia question, all right? For those that live in Missouri, it's probably really easy. What is the state tree of Missouri? And if anyone can answer that, you will earn a mug. or if you can Google really quick. All right. Oh, we have a winner. I do see a winner. And I have a funny feeling that our winner is a friend of mine. Is it Courtney Kelly is our winner? Oh my goodness, Courtney. Unfortunately, I might have to drive you your mug. That's good. <laughs> so <laughs> with coffee. Thank you, Courtney. And folks, it, like I said, if anyone has any questions about the expo, what I'm going to do right now, I'm going to provide my direct, my direct email address and also my direct phone number. If anyone has any questions or concerns, I'm very happy to, to, to answer them for you. Excellent. Thank you, John. You're very welcome. Thank you, everybody, for attending today. As it was mentioned before, we will make sure that um, the recording goes up onto the TCIA.org site. I will also make sure to send it via email to every person who was registered today so that you all have that as well. And again, we look forward to seeing everybody in St. Louis in just a few weeks. Take care, everybody. Do we have any Hi, other? Folks, we'll see you in St. Louis. Take care. All right.